Welcome back to the show. I know we've been going for a minute, but we back now. We got some heat coming for you. Uh, we've been transitioning. As you can see, we got a different set right now. We still fixing it up. But we getting everything ready. Today, we're going to talk about the January 6th hearings that's been going on. And before we get into that, like, comment, and subscribe. I'm one of your hosts, TK, a.k.a. The Story of Thought. And I'm Darius, a.k.a. The Mirror of Truth. And, and this, this is Mind the Gap. Yeah, I know, bro. We got it. He's coming in now, bro. I hope y'all appreciate this. Yeah. We ain't got air conditioning right yeah, now. Let's ride. So we doing this for y'all. We got to wrap it up tight. Look. All right. So today we're going to talk about the January 6th hearings and uh, kind of the new evidence that's been presented uh, in the, all of the foolishness mm -hmm. uh, that's been going on. One of which that I found interesting is that the fact that uh, Rudy was drunk, apparently. At the hey, bro. <laughs> that, I hey. mean, it's not surprising, though. Not he, surprising, he but. He said it. And I don't I don't know why anybody listened to him. I mean it's Rudy Giuliani. Yeah. But he was a he was a he was a uh he was a what was he like a hero or something like during 9 11 when he sent like people down there? I don't know. A hero is a strong word. It is in a strong my opinion. Word. It kinda yeah. it, it seemed like he just kinda took did the forefront. Yeah, he just did his job. Yeah. <laughs> I wouldn't I wouldn't call Rudy Giuliani a hero by any means. Okay. Well he was praised as one. Can I say that? <laughs> cause I, cause looking back, man, like if you go back and look at like some of the tapes, like especially like the Daily Show did a little examination, yeah. it was like he was, he was there, bro. Yeah, I mean he just happened to be what the mayor of New York. Yeah, he was like at the, the time, so he was kind of, mm -hmm. yeah, whatever. Anyway, at this point, he's he, it's foolish, yeah. and and him coming out and saying like we don't really have e evidence, but we have theories. Yeah, and you know saying stuff They're trying like to that. hold stuff up with 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 theories and not and having people march and uh. And go on that. I think that I ain't gonna say it's a crime, but it's definitely something that should be something, something should be done with people like that. Like well, like what? Influencing people to do something and encouraging them to do something based on theories. See, that's funny because theories. Yeah. Mm, I guess, man. I mean, to me, to me, you know, I, I think if if you incite a riot, you should be. What was it then? Huh? What was it then? I I agree. I'm saying, okay, but okay. you the person to say you can't, you should be able to get convicted on like inciting a riot. Oh, okay, like, okay, yeah, yeah. Because you because people still did their individual uh actions, but you, that's cool. But yeah, you know but saying? you lied. You know what I mean? You lied to the public. I feel like because I at this point I, I I say this at this point I think something should be done uh far as the law because. The people are not smart mm -hmm. enough to do it themselves. They didn't yeah, excommunicate yeah. them. They didn't say, "Hey, you know, this it has been proven that you are not right." Yeah, I think that's hard to do though because you have to prove intention. And I think I think you can you can weigh like the like the benefits of doing that versus not doing it. But those type of like libel disputes, you really have to prove that he knew the truth and that. He did, well, even if he knew the truth, he could he you we can't say he didn't feel like he said we had no stolen. evidence. Yeah, we have theories, right? And he said that it was stolen. Yeah. So at that point, you said yeah. it was stolen without any evidence. Right. But we had theories, and that's I all think that's, feelings. We can't convict that man. Like I can't put my he basically I can't put my finger on it. <laughs> but something is up. We can't like that's hard to. But ain't he like a lawyer or something, right? Huh? And he like a lawyer or something. He was. I think he got disbarred okay, because then. Well, of oh, January sixth. Then, then we're good. Then I think. The, I think the damage is done. I think the damage. Right, I mean, you. He, I mean, we just saw him. On, he was on Bad Singer, so he already. You know, he got the, the die sweating out. So yeah. you already know he's struggling out. I think it's all bad. Though. I think it's all bad. Just not just for for Trump to even like. You know, and it reported that he was happy when all the stuff was going down. You know, going through the hallways couldn't couldn't. Couldn't believe that nobody else was like that. Yeah, and saying like, you know, what's going on? It's like, yo, this is bad. You know, look, man, like we like because we are we already covered this. Y'all should go back and look at that initial reaction video mm -hmm. when it was happening. But my sentiments haven't really changed since that day. It's just that now that I'm seeing the hearings, I'm just like, oh yeah, they they really full of shit, or they yeah. really because like, I think you sent me the initial video when they did like the the newly released footage. 
like a little composite of Yo, bro. like everything that was really going down. That was violent. And I was like, it is worse than I thought it yeah, was. That and was I had violent. already imagined some like some wild stuff, but they was really off their rockers. Yeah, that was violent, bro. Yeah. I didn't realize I didn't realize that it was like the uh Capitol Police was really getting their ass beat like Yeah, that. they was getting handled, bro. I saw <laughs> that dude with this I don't know, I don't know where he got this maze from. But my man had this can of mace that was spraying like this orange mist. Mm -hmm. But that that stream was like ten, <laughs> that stream was like ten feet long. So I don't know where you get a long range like. Uh, no, I don't know. But he 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 sprayed it like three times. He tried to do it again. Nothing came out. He just he just yammed it. He was like, "I'm sick of y'all, bro." I don't I don't understand that though. I don't understand how people were calling it like a what do they call it like a witch hunt. Yeah, which I would would imply that there's nothing that happened, or 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 it doesn't exist. Yeah, or you know, are you talking about a witch hunt against who? Like looking for? Yeah, they they well, you know, they're saying that these are uh, insurrectionists, or they're saying that these are uh, people who committed treason and stuff like mm -hmm. that. I was like, nah, this was just a you know a uh, what what they call it, like a walkthrough or you know, are you talking about the people that are like defending them? defending like, oh, yeah like this is just like, yeah these, people this is, came yeah people came and like, got a little rowdy in yeah. there it was like no people have been killing themselves. i hate that because you know like if this is blm or something because mm -hmm. you already know like they, they're still talking about january 6th why would we not bro like yeah. they tried to overthrow the government yeah democracy like, was like, hey, it, it was only a few people it was only a few people that stood up to it yeah, that made it to where they couldn't do it. Right. If those few people didn't do it, then they would have overturned. Been, it would have been crazy. It would have been a problem. So, it's, it's, and then they wouldn't really. And the same people that would be like, "Nah, this was just a little uh, trip to the capital stuff." They got the text message saying, "Yo, <laughs> do you need to stop this? They bugging out Ooh. all the Tucker Carlson's, the what's it, the Laura Hannity. Ingrams, the Hannity. the Sean Hannity's, uh, uh, Mark Meadows, all the texting them. Trump and trying to get a hold of." Trump's kid talking about, hey, you need to stop this. And not only that, the ones that was asking for pardons. Yeah. I can't wait till them names come out. A few yeah. of them names already came out, but I can't wait till all them names come out. You, you, What did you ask for a pardon for? If you felt like everything was fine, everything yeah. was what do you need a pardon What do you need a pardon, for? Need a pardon, need a pardon for? for? Even Trump's own attorney general, Bill Barr, was like, this is, he. his words were, this is bullshit. Mm -hmm. You need to stop this. He's like, this is a lie. We don't have an attorney. And then his daughter agreed, was like, I respect Bill Barr's opinion. Yeah. That's why. Yeah. And like, then, it, but, but then a video came out of her doing, I think it was like a, a documentary or like a uh something she was doing. She had uh, recorded before she did the uh the hearing. Mm -hmm. She was like, Yeah, you know, uh we won. They stole it. It was like, why are you Till this day there has been no evidence of no. any type of fraud. And in, and, and, in a and, lot and, of cases, he, there were Republicans that was doing. Yeah, and, and when they found that people was actually doing stuff, it was Republicans that was found out. Like, and they got minimal jail time, like low low jail time. Meanwhile, somebody who didn't even know they, I remember yeah. it was like this black lady. She had uh, voted. She was a felon, mm -hmm. and they was like, "Well, yeah, you can vote," but she found out she couldn't vote. They gave her like five years. I was like, "That's bonkers, bro." I just want people. I just want people to take responsibility in their shit. They got like what four, what eight hundred people? Oh. All of them need to be charged, charged with something. At, at the very least, trespassing. Five years. At the, at the, at the minimum, minimum trespass. Oh, no, bro! If I see if I see you on TikTok <laughs> or Instagram or Facebook yelling that we killing Mike Pence, oh, you, you gotta go. You gotta go. Yeah, yeah, Trump threw Mike Pence right under yeah. the bus. He basically said, "If we lose this election, it's because of Mike Pence." I All that hating vitriol went straight to Mike Pence. To this day, Mike Pence ain't really popping like that. I don't understand how the American public or those people who did it, who ran up there, believe that the vice president can just be like, I don't no. agree with this. Yeah, and just stop <laughs> it and just like. I don't understand how that could be just a thing what that people believe. But they believe it because Trump said it was that way. They were at the Capitol because of Trump's text messages and his tweets. I don't. They went there like they had on, on the little, on the little uh, compilation video. Little mixtape oh, they dropped. Man. They had the lady saying the suit when she got it, he was like, We I can't say what's gonna happen, but y'all just stay tuned. Something gonna happen. Yeah. You got other people saying, We came here to start a problem. Mm -hmm. We start going getting into like the Proud Boys and Oath Keepers who were stockpiling weapons outside of DC. And they and they and they found documents of them planning to occupy key buildings in the Capitol. 
See, that's what I'm saying. Like, like, my, like I hope, like I want to, I want, I know that they uh going through the the, the process of you know charging them yeah. and giving them. I think they actually charged them with insurrection, right? Yeah, they actually gave them the that. dude Stewart. What's saying the the one that's over the oath keepers? He yeah. got charged with like treason. Like, yeah, he, treason. Yeah, I think yeah. one of them, I was like, yo, yeah, that's. I think they already was going in debt. They had yeah. already had oh, filed for like bankruptcy or something. They started like, you know, like we about to sue. Yeah. And now you got this on top of it. I mean, I want to see the end, but you know, because of how the system works, they probably gonna get out. They probably gonna get off. Oh, I, I don't know. I don't know about this one. Somebody got some at least somebody gotta take the charge. How everything switching to more uh conservative beliefs and how more people being in power, yeah. the they may they may get off. I think that they just go make them uh scapegoat. I think they're just gonna sacrifice Ooh. them. I I I, I agree. Because you know they quick to do that too. If we can just give you all this and if, move if, I on, give you, if I can just yeah. give you a body, yeah. you know what I'm saying? I gotta give you a Because we, we may not go through and prosecute all prosecute all eight hundred people, but we'll give you two leaders. You can <laughs> yeah. have them. They ain't nobody to us. They got the real power. Oh, you can have uh, the, the Spanish dude, whatever his name is, and Stuart. About the snitch? Yeah. You yeah. can have them. We don't we care. Have snitch. Yeah. We got the rest of them. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, yeah, them, bro. We got way more than them. So, what you think the, the minimum should be for all eight hundred people? I want treason. It's about time. Oh, time at least five. Five years, I agree with that. The, the, like, I bro, agree with that. like the way they were five talking years. during BLM and like George Floyd protests about property uh, damage and stuff, and, and the time they were handing out, mm -hmm. you attacked the capital, the, the center capital. of democracy. At the very least, five years. While saying that anybody that was trying to kill Mike Pence or anybody that was saying Nancy we was going to do Nancy Pelosi or uh, anything, we 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 here to uh, overturn the election. Anybody yeah. that got caught saying that minimum for me five years, easy minimum for easy. Me five years. Because to me that's beyond the threat because you there, yeah. you doing it, to be you breaking real, the window, be, you like you in there. And anybody that's about all that patriot shit, all that all that like you know nationalism and stuff like that, anybody that believe in that, you should be saying they should get ten. Facts. If you believe that, you should be saying that. Well, yeah, they should get ten years on Bruh, top. Like this whole, this whole patriot nationalism, nationalism take back our country rhetoric. That's really killing us. <laughs> that's really killing us, bro. Because oh, I, 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 I just don't see how people go that hard for something so completely false. I mean, it starts with uh, for me, uh, and I think this is a big thing on it, I think I'm gonna do like a little or uh, like mini like uh, episode on it. Yeah. It starts off for me because I, I love history. It starts off for me from the people not being able to accept that the uh, that is their fault. No, nah, people that that uh, Confederacy, the Confederacy uh, lost. Mm -hmm. It starts there. It starts with America really being sore losers and not being able to. You ever been having a conversation with somebody? Y'all talking about sports and they like the refs cheated. Oh yeah, because they team lost. Because they team lost. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Yeah. It starts for me. They still talk about Durant toe being on that line. Yeah, it, it's for me. It's it's always that you know they people gotta get paid. Yeah. Who do you know that done that? Yeah. Well, I don't know. I'm just you. Just what? You Assume. just what? You well, tell just... me. Well, tell me a story. Tell me a story. That's what absolutely. You know. You know. You know what I. You know what I figured out recently, man. Like by, like I don't know, like tragic flaw, like in the crucible. Mm -hmm. Or yeah. whatever, or what I really, I, I think I view ignorance as like a sin. Like I, I, <laughs> it bugs me. Like the, it bugs me when people talk with so much confidence about something they know nothing. Does about. something about they know nothing about, or they theorize of. Because yeah. if I just ask, so like, give me like hard evidence of what you're talking about. Mm -hmm. They don't know the difference between something making sense mm -hmm. and actually having tangible evidence. Like, like mm -hmm. if I if I give you an example of, oh my, some dude shot such and such around the corner, they'll say, yeah, I think it was him. Like I believe it was him because I saw him leaving there. Mm -hmm. I saw him. Uh, he was in a rush. Yeah, evidence like that. But if I say, where's the gun? Yeah, show me the gun with the fingerprints on it. Mm -hmm. Then it's like, well, I don't have that. But I, everything else, yeah. I got them on camera. I got all the. They don't know the difference between circumstantial evidence mm. and actual. Yo, where's the gun with the handprint on it? I agree with that, but I also agree. I also would say it that we at the point where that doesn't matter. 
Yeah, be, that's like, what's scary. Yeah, it, it, it even with the that, to, to to your point, let's reverse it. Let's say that the person did do it. There is evidence of the gun and the fingerprints. They'll say he didn't do it. You feel what I'm saying? No, that's crazy. That, that's where we at. That's now. crazy because, like, yeah, like I was saying, when you show a video of them of uh, it was attorney general saying this is bullshit, this mm -hmm. is not real. They'll look Lawyers at it like saying like you out, you are out your effing mind yeah, if you believe right. it. And that's oh man, it was the uh, it was the uh, what would say it was like the the briefcase that was under the what's the name? Well, it's it, he. I'm testifying that it, what happened was we told them they can go. Yeah. And then they was like, no, you can't go. So they pulled everything back out so they could start back counting. Yeah. If you watch the full video, you'll see people have putting their coats on and then taking their coats off to go back and recount. Yeah. Evidence. Now I don't care about that. That's that could be doctored. Yeah. That's Photoshop. It's like well, my, it's my point is if that doesn't convince you, then what will? Why are we going through this farce if no matter what I show you, lock them up. You're not gonna believe anyway. Because at that point, I believe in Sun Tzu, Sun, uh, Sun Tzu. He said, "Listen, there should be a clear, a clear uh, uh, line of reward and punishment," and that's how I believe. Just punish. Because mm. <laughs> at this point, evidence doesn't matter. I used to, I used to think, "Hey, man, people can be reasoned too," but you know what I'm saying. At this point, it's you just it's, it's dead, bro. I mean, what's the point? And, it, and for me, it, it traces back to like the Civil War. It traces back if if people today are still having reenactments. I think this it traces war of you line of, of people. Like I told you before, like uh, I'm gonna have this in my series too. It's gonna be like about Wade Hampton. Wade Hampton is named after a general, a Confederate general who was a white supremacist with slaves. Mm. But yet we got black and brown kids. And white kids Pre go to their predominantly. School, predominantly, they go to their school and have to be proud and show like, you know what I'm saying? And it look like a prison. And, and have pride in that school. Yeah. How? Why do we still got names of losers and people and, and traitors? Why do why, why do we people do fight so hard for that? Why we got statues and stuff? Oh, it's history. Hey. No, it's it's cool to have hey. history. You can go to Germany and they can yeah. tell you about what happened. Yeah, but they got a statue of they got a yeah, statue. Yeah. You won't find a statue of Hitler anywhere. Anywhere. You won't find a statue of Hitler's dog. So that that's that 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 seed there. That I was think planted long I time think ago. that goes back further than the Confederacy, though. I don't think so. I think like I like I said before, man. There's just a human flaw in us. Oh, you talk about that? Yeah, yeah. Of course. If I was you talking can, about America. Okay, yeah, in America, probably even more. Even, but it might go back further than that because we, we gotta look into that, like our relationship with Britain and all that. Because I'm hearing like that ain't really they ain't up and up on why yeah. we left in the first place. So. It it just might be we we just easily a uh, susceptible to like good branding or a certain certain type of brand. Of course, like I told you when I was looking up uh, fascism, it's, yeah. that's basically what it is. If you it's, can control the crowd, give yeah. them what they want, not the truth, right. then they'll they'll do anything for you. If it. you feed somebody, if you feed they 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 ego and they and they emotions, and you can really if you latch feed, on to them, if you feed they id. Yeah. Was that little devil on their shoulder? If you feed the ear, they yeah. do anything. They the it. reason why. Cold? I've been saying he was bringing back cold. <laughs> cold? And my, my dad was like, yeah, let's yeah. do that. Yeah. Cold? That's what gets y'all excited. Well, I know this going to get them up. And they did. And cold dropped like, I think it was like 17% when he was out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's probably more. You Bro, I just don't, I just don't, at this point, I just don't understand people. It's just that, see, for me in America, the the strongest thing because that's the one that we remember the most is this 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 that seed of us just doing it over and over still still got cow peas or like you know places around that's named out the you know streets out the confederate mm -hmm. generals and stuff like that yeah and that's the seed for me that I see now of what we can't take losing mm -hmm. we can't take the fact that or the, being wrong or, or being wrong or taking ownership but we are part of the problem oh that's oh that I, that's a whole nother that's that's, a, a that's the discussion nother. bro like because it like I be saying, man, like it, the people up top don't really get, don't really care. Like no, the, the laws and stuff line. don't even really affect them. Mm -hmm. It's the people at the bottom that be fighting the hardest to keep things status quo. Like what I see, like oh man, like stay stay tuned for this McCarthyism episode I'm about to drop. Mm -hmm. And we see things like that, and we see people fighting so hard. Against policies and stuff that's actually to benefit you, benefit the people, the people, and people are like, no, I don't want to hand out. My boy, what? The same one complaining about your kid can't get free lunch. Same one. I don't get it. I don't get why people fight so hard against their own best interests when they kid. really don't understand the principles behind what they're saying. It's it's uh, it's the old saying. This is what I don't I don't uh. 
I don't buy into this this idea. I think it's I, also it's just like I buy into it because of how people react, but not person. It's like uh, people say it's not what you say; it's how you say it. Thank you. You know what I'm saying, but for the but for the, the crowd, that's what it is. How yeah. you say things, yeah. How alluring can you be? How charismatic can you be? So yeah. So what? Honest truthful? or whatever. So truthful. How? Yeah. He has been proven that this man has lied more than any other president. And pre- even when he don't have to, he just be lying. Yeah. He just and, go off on the tangent. Yeah. And all presidents yeah. lie. Yeah. And you don't lie the most. That's Come crazy. On now. Come on now. I don't. I don't. I don't. Come on. Like and then it's proven. Okay, he said this. Yeah, he did say that. Yep. Yeah, he said that. Well, he said that too, but they, they, they don't go together. That doesn't, that's a direct. That's <laughs> a contradiction what you're saying, my boy. Yeah, but I, I still love him. Say, well, say Why? that. Don't say, don't say he, he talks straightforward because yeah. he's a lie. <laughs> a lie is not straightforward. I'm, t- I'm, t- I'm just tired of seeing all these videos of people riding with this man and then somebody showing the proof and mm-hmm. they'll be like, well, I still, I still think he's the best option. But for me, is is I, 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 I'm only gonna say this because the whole is worse from what they do. Mm. It's like I can accept that to a degree. I still, I, I still think he's the best option. Then for you to say, uh, uh, that's a robot or that's an alien, that's a lizard, or, or that's a clone. Or clone. You know what I'm saying? These it's, are it's, actual things people have said. Yeah. That's not really Ivanka. That's a clone. They they can do anything nowadays. Have you, who what can, what can they do? Who, who who did you hear that from? Who's doing it? Well, I don't know. I just think people at the top is okay. Okay. Hey, the people don't care, bro. People just need. I need a cause. They need a cause, man. Like I see oath keepers and crowd boys and all the people at January sixth. There's people like they busy body. They need mm-hmm. something to do. Because people like. They, not in terms of race, but if you black, bro, you know what the struggle is. Like, we know what it is. Yeah. We got enough issues. We don't yeah. need to make up some shit <laughs> to feel <laughs> like to feel like we doing something. Yeah. We don't need to travel to the Capitol to mm-hmm. defend democracy when democracy's not in danger. Like I said before, they don't give a shit because they don't care about gerrymandering. No. They don't care about redlining and shit. Like, they no. don't care about none of that they don't stuff. Care about voting or rights. All they these voting about... rights that been passed for years mm-hmm. and stripping away. They only kill once it hit them. Yeah. Like that's what it's I. It's too late. Buddy. It's too late. It's way too late. Like with the, some of the other topics we're gonna get into, but like when people, people only see the struggle once they in it. Yeah. They don't see it coming. Yeah. And those who do see it coming don't do nothing. Mm-hmm. He's just like I'm gonna prepare me and mine, and then I'm gonna go about my business. Like myself, I'm bad about that. I mm-hmm. can see something. I like he gonna fall. I know he gonna fall. And I'll sit down and watch. It. Oh, I know this is gonna get bad. Let me make sure I get this bad. Yeah. Because first of all, I'm a person I like watching chaos. I enjoy it. You know what I'm saying? I I enjoy watching stuff. Mm-hmm. But like other people who feel like they should do something and they can see it and they and they can't. I think they should do something, but they not. And I think the biggest reason is because the crowd is so hard to overcome. Yeah, it's like, and why what, bother, man? Why put out all that effort just to be told I'm crazy? And I want to say it was Mussolini that said it. It said, uh, he said, uh, if you give the crowd the things that they want and not the truth, they'll do anything for you. Yeah. But those who tell them the truth and the things that they don't like become a victim. Mm. So I do understand. Like when you say when you have like uh people showing up to regular volunteer or uh, office workers that just work the voting booths and stuff like that, you come to their grandmother's house mm. or you knock on the door trying to find them saying we're gonna kill you and stuff like that, it makes a person that don't really care enough to do anything, yeah. especially not want to do nothing. Like, I'm not doing that. No, you're not about to come to my house and do that. Yeah. I'm going to catch a charge. Yeah. Yeah, man. And then you see it so much. You, also, you kind of just lose empathy. But it's like, I can see if I can't choose it. Yeah. Why Like why? Why should I have to go through the- That's a good point, too. Through the trouble of- Explaining this to explaining you. Explaining you. Like, I got it. Why don't you get it? Are we looking at it? Like, that's why I say- That's like, a good point. Like I say, is you, like, you can't really control what people believe. Like, you don't know what that piece of evidence is. That'll make somebody go, ah, I got it. Because we looking at the same evidence. I told, I, I, me and my homeboy got the argument about this. I said, man, everybody can be taught. He said, TK, no, no. He said, it's going to be about 10% of people that you're going to be able to reach, and that's it. Yeah. And I used, me, he used to get arguing bad about that until I grew up. So I read a little bit more, and I was like, you know what? I still agree with what I said. It's just a hundred ways to teach somebody, and I ain't got time to teach somebody yeah. in the three ways, the only three ways they know how to learn. Yeah. <laughs> I know, and what's hard is if there's a hundred ways to teach, 
people only know how to teach three ways. And people oh, only learn how to three ways. And those three ways may be at the and end of they, the spectrum. And you never No oh, man. That that's that's a good point too. That's crazy. That's crazy. And that's only like I may only know one way. To teach, like, <laughs> yeah. So the odds are like the odds are like, yo, what how are we ever oh, gonna reach each yeah. other? So it's not it's yeah. not it's not as if people are incapable of being taught. It's just yeah. that the way you got to show them, yeah. Yeah, how do you put in the time and the effort and like to go through all 100 ways until we find out? That's, the, that's you know, that's probably what education says. Like, we trying to figure that out that's now. Right. You can't. That's why it's easier to do it in the crowd because yeah. crowd thinking is much easier to get the results than individual. Mm. If I get you in the crowd, you're yeah. just going to follow anyway, mm. which is what they're doing, following. There's a few people in there that kind of get it. Few people know that's really racist or really yeah. don't like the fact that they them are. the ones who got the loudest voices though. Oh, the absolutely. ones be with the megaphones, absolutely saying "Hang, uh, Hang Mike Pence," and then everybody else just you know yeah. chanting too. I'm I like I like I understand like because I found myself watching that footage because I know I've been part of some some dumb shit just because I'm there. I'm like, well, shit, I'm here now. I'm here let, now. Me, yeah. let me just yeah. see what's going on. <laughs> I get. I, I'm pretty sure there was people that was like, "Well, the the, the windows already busted." Yeah, I might. Well, yeah, I, I didn't might, bust. They just they in there just honestly just admiring what's going on. But then you see somebody get shot, and you like, "Whoa!" Yeah, well, that's your fault. Like, yeah. if we oh, if 100%. we in a car, if we in the car, and then somebody weed, don't nobody fess up. They arrest everybody. Yeah. If you if you were in the capital, you yeah, decided you, you, you go in there. Up. Guess what happens? That'll teach your ass to stop hanging around dumb people. <laughs> yeah. Doing dumb shit. That's what you tell us. Or it might not teach. If it don't, then I don't know. That's your fault. But yeah, I just, I just don't like the the hearing those hearings. Like one lady was saying that she was slipping the blood. Uh, I think she was an officer. And then she, I remember how I, I the way she described it. I I got. She said she had when they pushed the gate back, she had fell or something. And she remember like trying to you know, get herself down. She was looking up and see all the commotion, people moving and stuff. And I, was like, I thought that was just like a war. It looked like that. That's it what it looked like. like. I felt like she was like I felt like I was in danger. You know? Yeah, like. And really was, you know, you got a lot of them like committing suicide after the, a lot of that stuff. But you got a lot of people like they 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 weren't able to to deal with, and still not able to. Like one lady, the, the lady, the lady and her mother, or her grandmother and her mother, say they can't even like they they are so they so afraid. she doesn't take her mother to the grocery store with her anymore mm. because she was afraid that she was going to yell her name down the house. I'm like my kids. Mm. She was harassed so much yeah. by like people saying, "We know you sold that. Like, we know you uh, pushed the machine." And so he said, "I felt so bad." I said, "All I want to do is like you know, do my duty to this country." Yeah, I am being harassed. Like, yeah, and now I'm afraid to go out to eat because somebody may do something to my food, or take right? My phone or do something to my grandmother. The FBI told her grandmother that she had to go hide for people that uh, not heard her call the nine one one. They were banging on her door. She's like, "Oh Lord Jesus, where's the police?" Like, yeah, scared. yeah. I'm thinking, that's, I'm thinking that's my that's heartbreaking. And that could be anybody. She just doing her job. She there. And she, that was a grandmother. That wasn't the, the daughter was the one that working there. They yeah. found the grandmother and was bothering her. Like, like what is that? <laughs> I, and I really want people to I want them taking accountability for these people. I'm tired of people like these are these aren't real uh right wingers or followers. Of like what we believe in, like nah, those are the people. Mm -hmm. Those are the people you ride with. They don't know. They don't, they they claim your side. Yeah. I, I like I want I want real accountability, and yeah. I want a, people to accountability for people who added to all this nonsense, like Tucker Carlson and all that. Stop trying to distance yourself from your conservative side or something like that. No, all of that is over there. Marjorie Taylor. Because if Green. you want if you want the left to take responsibility for people like Antifa or some stuff That's like that, I was, you need to take care. of are these fools here? Those, yeah. those are your people. That's right. Cause I'm sick of it. Like, don't don't try to like distance yourself. Like, no real conservatives will be dignified. No real conservatives are fucking nuts. Yeah, the, the, them niggas are crazy. The, the worst the worst part about that is, for me, it's nothing that you can really do by law, but that's up to the people listening to. Them. Mm -hmm. And if you can't reach them. And and the thing that the the crazy thing about that, what people really don't understand about those type of crowds that people they get to follow, like whether it be Tucker Carlson or whether it be Ted Cruz, Marjorie Taylor Green, any of them, they eventually eat you. Yeah, as yeah. we see, bro. If you do one, if you don't do something, they like, like like going back to Mike Pence. They yeah. will, they will try. They will. They will. You were the enemy. Yeah. You a spy. Did you you see not what with they did us. To Ted Cruz. 
What happened to him? What, no, what, I'm talking about that's about like uh uh like a man ran up on him, like harass him, uh 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 right a right winger ran up on him like like hey you you so you shouldn't Playing do how, fire, feel, yeah, how you feel about leaving your uh yeah. your, your state to go to Cancun with your kids and then he's like, you know, you're not really a Trump like all that type of stuff. Yeah. And another dude, the dude with the like the one eye, they got the pack, mm. he got attacked the same, I think it was the same week. Cringe, what's his name, John? Something Crenshaw? Yeah, something like that. Yeah. They attacked him the same the same way. It was like, see, that's what y'all get. Yeah. Y'all, y'all about to be eating alive. Cause y'all trying y'all. to appease the uh, appease these people to get mm-hmm. these votes and stuff like that. No, you playing with fire, you my playing man. With fire, but you, don't, you that's something you cannot control. Yeah, that's something. Once you get once you get a crowd or a group of people, once once you once your base is about riling people up, they fanatics. They yeah. not once, once are, you become, yeah once you become a they're once, not reasonable people. No. Nah. No, so they they are people that that go off emotion. Yeah, but emotion. It's like Crank, that movie Crank with uh Jason Statham. That's all it is. They yeah. have to stay like that. If yeah. you don't keep them like that, then it's a and we it, need we need somewhere to direct this yeah. energy, bro. We and need, it will be you. They they remind me of you seen Mad Max, the new one. Yeah, yeah. With the the crazy people that be huffing the silver paint and stuff like yeah. that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Those are those people. <laughs> well, you've been sold. That's what they become into. Yeah, That's I can't they, come down. Yeah, I've been I've been living this truth and trying to die for glory for so long. I need mm-hmm. it. Don't matter who the enemy is or what they talking about. We 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 ride. We about to get in these doom buggies and we about to yeah, ride out. Yeah, yeah. you know what I'm saying. <laughs> it don't matter who it, it is. It don't matter who it what's is. What's the reason? And if you turn on us, then we just gonna direct it because it's going somewhere. Yeah, the energy going. You somewhere. just have me right here. I might as well. Yeah, you. Know, I, I've been watching and I've been laughing at it. I'm like, I love it. Yeah. Cause you just gonna get eaten alive, bro. And 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 and, and, and you see these people that's uh that's running for these office seats. All they doing is trying to act crazy to other. Let me tell you, I seen one. Margie lady. Taylor is doing a hell of a job. I seen this one lady, bro. Black hard lady. to out crazy her. It was black lady, bro. She said, uh, "Living with your love, girlfriend or boyfriend is a gateway before you before you get married." Is a gateway uh, or fornicating before marriage is a gateway to pedophilia. I was like, "Yo, this is y'all are getting out of hand. Y'all are getting way out of hand for this now." <laughs> she said that, bro. Like she was just like, "Oh, uh, just this talking reckless, bro." Who's checking? Who's checking her though? Nope. That's what I'm saying. It, it, it's those people. Those people are only checked by the people. And if you got people that's okay with listening and stuff like that, then it's like if it's you a, already think every government person is. Secret pedophiles and all this. Stuff. You just like, yeah, I didn't. I didn't have sex before I married. Yeah, not it wasn't. I didn't have a choice in the matter. But you know, I still didn't have that, sex in the matter. That's yeah. the crazy thing about it. That's a, that's another point because the people that will believe her are people still having sex and living with their boyfriend or girlfriend without you know what I'm saying being oh, yeah, married. Man, but I, but, we but I agree. I agree. We different. We, different. You know we plan to get yeah, married. Yeah, I know okay them. To, yeah, I know them. You know what I'm saying. So it's like and the, the thing I want people to like because because these type of fanatics. Are they got a real poison of America to me? Like people mm-hmm. that fanatical, because like I say, at least when you see like a George Floyd riot or something, because don't get wrong, we riot and stuff too. Yeah, but at least it's it's b- about something, something mm-hmm. real, like a real issue. That there's, we evidence. Have there's evidence. There's evidence or something. You know, even if you want to say they they overreacted, mm-hmm. at least the reaction was to something tangible something we historically have a problem with you know what i'm saying but when you when you have people that were riot over something fabricated that's when you should take a step back and like maybe we shouldn't feed into these people you know what i'm saying it's one thing to like uh back in the day when you row like a union up yeah. oh no they they taking our wages you know they giving our jobs away or something like that but these people will just make up a lie or a story and just feed it to people and just let them, and just let them get bigger and bigger. And then mm-hmm. when they explode, they be like, "I don't know what, I don't know how I got to that point. I don't but, know what we doing." But that's such is life, though. That's how it always is. Yeah. There's no, there's no, there's no way. It's it, it's just like the stock market. It's just a bubble. Yeah. And then eventually, and, yeah. And then it's got to come back market. up. Yeah. And but the thing is, like, I, I I actually think that at this point, it's out of control because I think the people who thought they had the control are afraid. They are they, afraid to move now because they don't want to upset them, but they know like, but we can't listen. We can't we can't ride with this either, but we also can't be like just completely alienated. One, because yeah. they paying our bills, and two, Ooh, they that's will, a big one. 
they will show up at our house yeah, if they yeah, have not to, bro. Playing, bro. And on both sides, bro, you see what it was about? My man's about to run up on, uh, what was that, Supreme Court judge? Brett Kavanaugh? Yeah. yeah. What's happening right now, the people who, who they not really in control, like the, all the, the lawmakers and stuff that got these people riled up, what's happening is they're going down the highway at uh, 100, uh, mile, 100 miles per hour, no brakes, and a curve. Break, the brakes been cur- cut. And the curve is coming up. And you barely able to switch yeah. lanes right now. That's that's basically what happened. Eventually, yeah. this is going this is going to be a terrible yeah. accident, and nobody going and everybody going like everybody going to be doing a lot of backpedaling. Everybody going to be doing a lot of oh man, I didn't know it was going to be this. And like, oh no, they actually this, know now. This is what it is now. And I, and I think it's going to get to the point where it's going to be on both sides. See, the problem for me is Democrats is too weak, right? You know what I'm saying? And conservatives is too much about the money and not the people. Yeah, and that's what I'm saying. The Democrats too much about the people. Hey. You know, but don't get me wrong, we got corporate Democrats too, because a lot of them. Yeah, I'm just talking about the overall. Overall, yeah. Talking about the overall. The overall. They don't want to. They they're afraid to push that button. They still trying to. Like, they want to play by the rules. But who's doing Ain't that? No, but yeah, if, cause that's that's why I res- at least I respect that conservatives. Like we want something, we gonna get it done. Yeah, period. You know what I'm saying? It don't matter. You know what I'm saying? You know what I, don't what like, I don't care how y'all side yeah, feel. You're right. Y'all all right, but we're not gonna vote we not, on it. We're not voting on that. <laughs> we're not voting we don't on care. that. We don't care. We hypocrites. Yeah. We don't care if we <laughs> say, oh, y'all yeah. trying to hold our Supreme Court judge yeah. up. We don't care. We're gonna do that to y'all though. And then when and then when they get to us, we ain't we ain't gonna let y'all do it. Yeah. Basically what they did. The only reason that's Democrats' fault. When Obama, when Obama was out trying to pick, they uh uh what was that? Uh Mitch held it up. Yeah. The, doing the same Trump did the same thing, then just let it go. And that's why we're in the position that we in. Right. Now. So. Last year they tried to get a bill back better bill passed mm-hmm. to hold up with the Republicans and like uh, Joe Manchin oh, and the other girl now, who, who really ain't Dem- Democrats. Let's yeah. just call them. They not Democrats. They, you know what they, on, they on whoever side paying. I say I feel Joe like. Biden. Uh, I said Joe, Joe. Biden. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Joe Biden's. Joe Biden uh, lost that 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 whole thing because he they was like we ain't signing this but we'll do the infrastructure bill and then other Democrats like we not signing the infrastructure bill because they just gonna get that. And they're not going to sign the bill better, bigger, but better. They was and like, hey, what happened? Just, and what happened? That's what happened. Mm-hmm. And then Joe Biden from then was like, well, I can't, I can't do that. I can't do nothing. I can't do nothing. My hands are tied. My I, hands are, like, what are you, what are you doing, my guy? He's like, you literally had executive power to just do stuff if you wanted to right now. But you only do so much with that, though. The thing for me is like, you should have enough power to look at uh, Mr. Manchin and be like, hey, man, your, your daughter. Squeeze his ass. Like, you want to see your daughter outside of prisons any yeah. Ever again, <laughs> yeah. jacking up these insulin prices. Yeah, you better sign this bill. Yeah, holla at you. Oh, because if not, then you know, <laughs> what else? You know what I'm saying? She gonna wait till the uh, day. I'm gonna have to wait until this other uh, this <laughs> president, other president get at, in. at least, and, and hope you get yeah. a pardon. Because I'm, I'm, I'm putting, I'm putting put so much litigation around this uh, this case, boy. <laughs> nobody want to touch. This. Yeah, ain't nobody gonna touch this, bro. This, this on, is, man. And that's the thing for me, bro. They don't. They, they just, they are too weak. Only person I think I still respect is Bernie Sanders. Because he's still out here talking the same shit he's been talking for years. I respect OLC. And then what's my man name? Yeah, uh, yeah. I expect that whole little, 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 little horseman trio yeah. guy. You know what I'm saying? And my man, uh, the either white dude, he said he ain't running no more, though. Buttigieg? His, yeah, his, no, not Buttigieg. I'm talking about the, No, he's not. He's a Republican. Rourke? Uh, Better or Rourke? Yeah, his family just got threatened. Uh-huh. Yeah, him. That uh, He's like yeah. a war veteran. That's the, that's the one that dude that ran up on uh, Abbott. It was like, you ain't doing shit. Well, after oh, not that guy, but I respect him too. Uh, I think he was a Democrat. I'm talking about the dude that uh, he's on the hearing. He's like the only. He like it's two Republicans: Liz Cheney and then him. Who else on there? It's a white dude, bro. He got name. It's a white dude. I can't think of his name. I apologize if y'all can hear what's going on in the back. I apologize. <laughs> this is that's the neighbors, or whatever. Yeah. I can't think of his name, bro. But he he. He his wife and family's got there. They threatened to kill his uh like five month old or something. Yeah, five year old. Five like how you old. back people like that? How you how you ride for people they that can, are they kill still, your family? They can still speak and say what those like you said earlier. They can still speak and say these are not the Republicans. These are not our Republicans. That was somebody else. So when I speak, I'm not you, speaking to them. You, bro, like I'm I'm tired of the separation. Just own it, bro. Like y'all bugging, bro. Go to their house. Look at the yeah. paraphernalia they got. Look, yeah. at, look at the flags they got on their walls. Yeah. Do you think they Democrats? Do you think they do you think they on the other side? Or I, do you... I think they just separate themselves from I, I am a conservative. I, they have different names for it, but they have like, I'm this type of conservative. Yeah. They are this type of conservative, and I'm not with it. Either way, they ain't they ain't ride with me. Yeah. Now I think that's a I think that's a problem too that we keep looking at stuff like two party systems. Yeah. Like, we all need all this is trash. 
All this is trash. Everything burn it, rebuild. Yeah. That's why they never let somebody like me as president. I'm too Let me tell you all too Actually, honest, bro. Aliens exist and uh we in trouble. Okay, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta I was it. watching this. I've been watching Orville. Have you heard that? The one Seth MacFarlane made, the one who made Family Guy. He got this like a comedic drama version space, of like, yeah, yeah, Star Trek or whatever. I have, I have and they be traveling to different planets and like they got these rules not to interfere. Like if a planet is too primitive or whatever. Yeah. And I'd be like, they out there and they looking at us and we just look dumb. Like we look so goddamn primitive. To like other life forms that it's yeah. embarrassing. Like I'm embarrassed for us. As 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 animals and uh, there's animals and insects and stuff that that live on this planet that has better systems. Yeah, like, it's just like that's communism. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> that's what that is. Ain't nobody yeah, want that. Yeah, yeah, nobody want. Nobody want to share work. Yeah, nobody want yeah. that. They want to be the heroes. Yeah. They want to make the most money. And if I can't do it, somebody else got to be a problem. Capitalism, yeah. Capitalism, trash, bro. I don't, I don't get, I don't get the appeal, man. Mm -hmm. Well, unchecked capitalism. You know unchecked. What I'm saying? Yeah, it's yeah, all, yeah. it's all about a balance. All, all, all of them work. Every you know what I mean? But it's just the extent that we of control that we didn't took it. That we didn't really took it too far. Is like, yeah. That's what that's, that's like. Such was, like I was say earlier. Such was like that, but that, that's what's gonna happen. We gonna take it too far because we don't know no better. That's if all we know how to do in a, in in history. All it is is like a newly conquered civilization civilization will start building up, and then they'll start expanding, and then they'll get to the point where it implodes, and then they'll branch off, and then mm -hmm. it starts right back over again. That's all it is. Bro. What do you say? What did you say? The the, the average lifespan of an empire two hundred fifty years, yeah, and then it implodes. And yeah. we've been here since what sixteen, seventeen hundred. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Only a matter of time. Yeah, we do. Yeah, I've been enjoying it. Bro. I like. I like this. Just, fall. I would just rather. I I want to. I'm I'm curious to see how everything gonna play out. I think that's my main thing too. Because I I know at this point I'm moving. I gotta yeah. move. So this is America is is. It's for the birds, bro. The country's gonna be like, y'all, y'all need to. No. I know y'all want to come, but we got a limit here, bro. Y'all gotta. <laughs> oh, cool. That's what I'm getting in early. Yeah. yeah. That's what I do. Like, y'all ain't about to pour. Y'all ain't about to bring that over here. <laughs> <laughs> you think I'm just about to bring that? No. Nah. I believe it, bro. Bro. We gotta come up with an arrangement. So, hey, bro, like, yeah. Like, during this time, you can't. Need you, like, not make noise. <laughs> I think he on the bottom level, though, so that might be his little thing. Oh, you think so? Yeah. Or is this little area? Shit. I, mean, I, ain't, I, ain't, I ain't got no more talk. Yeah, I ain't got I no ain't, more for that. I ain't. Oh. That's it. All right, man. I appreciate it if you lasted this long during the conversation. Let us know what your thoughts are, how you feel about the January hearing. I know we went off on a little tangent, but it's yeah. all it's all in the same realm. So. Okay. You got any final, final thoughts with that, man? No, nah, that's it for me. I'll be careful out here. Oh, they trash. And if you're watching with hate, I appreciate you too. Yeah, a view is a view. Yeah, I appreciate you. Uh, and as always, mind, mind the, the gap. gap.